I basically slept all day and it's 3 in the morning on Monday. I didn't sleep all day because I had to go help load Xanadu stuff back into the school. But anyways, yeah. And then I woke up and I ended up watching the Grammys. But I'm making this video because I missed last week and I suck at life. Seriously, give me a punishment. I need one. So last week was, uh, the theme was bucket lists and I have a really, really bizarre bucket list so I'm gonna do that theme anyways. There's three things, right? Well, one thing I want to do is I want to set the world record for largest sculpture made out of chewed bubblegum because that is not a record that's been set yet and I really want to do that. My second thing on my bucket list is I want to buy a house and seal it and then I want to flood it and go scuba diving in this house with all the furniture in it because that way you can be in this house full of water scuba diving and then you look out the window and everything is normal but inside it's it's like a sunken house and I just think that would be the coolest thing third thing on my bucket list oh god I have so many things on my bucket list how do I choose I want to set up a giant game of golf cart polo uh, you know that, that sport where people ride around on horses and they hit a ball with like a croquet club thing. Um, polo, basically, yeah, I'm thinking that. Except you're in a golf cart and you have to be in partners and one person would hit the ball and the other person would steer. And it would be ridiculous and cost a lot of money, but I want to do that. Okay, this week's theme is to come up with a theme. And I think we should just have a really feel-good week where we talk about something we like about ourselves and usually you shouldn't encourage narcissism but we have a really nice modest group here except for Robin no I'm kidding but um yeah so just for a week I think we should talk about something we really like about ourselves cuz I mean we're teenagers sometimes we need that reminder or something I don't know it's early okay I had a challenge to chug some beverage, and this was from Melissa. I don't have beverage on me right now. I think I'm gonna go make tea at 3 in the morning. Bottoms up. I think it's still hot too, so this could end in a spluttering mess. Yeah, still hot. Do I actually have to chug it? I guess I could wait, but I'm not sure if I'm feeling that smart yet. Okay, yeah, I might have to let that sit for a bit. <sighs> Today was super mega foxy awesome hot because, uh, I basically got to sleep and yesterday, well the day before yesterday now, days are weird, but anyways, Saturday there was the cast party for um, Xanadu since it all finished up and whatnot, and it was a toga party. I didn't know people actually did toga parties, I thought that was just a cliche, but nope, they happen. It was pretty rad. Yeah, I feel like I need more dance parties in my life challenge, which means I need the dice. Oh, uh, they're always over there. I should just keep them on the floor. I challenge whoever I roll to tell us what would be a surefire way to get you to be somebody's valentine. Like, for instance, on Tumblr, there's been a bunch of really awesome nerdfighter valentines that have been floating around. If anybody gave me that, yeah, I'm basically sold. So, yeah, tell us what would be a good way to ask you to be someone's valentine. I don't think there was any grammar in that sentence. Done. This would have been a lot easier if I just let it sit, but I am an impatient human being. 
Okay, I think that was everything. Um, DFTBA, sorry I suck at life, and Robin, I will see you today.